House is accused of posting a doctor video of the incident this week that involves CNN reporter Jim Acosta and a White House intern. Take a look. Folks, that's that, enough. Pardon me, ma'am. I'm, I'm, Mr. Excuse President, me. that's enough. Mr. President, I one of the questions, if I may ask. That's the actual incident that happened on Wednesday during the tense exchange between Acosta and the President. A White House intern stepped up and tried to take the mic back from Acosta. As she reached for it, his hand brushed her arm and he said, pardon me. This is the video that was posted by the White House press secretary, Sarah Sanders. She stood by the decision to suspend Acosta's press pass. She said the administration would not tolerate behavior seen in the video. The Associated Press asked an independent video producer to compare the two versions. One, it's uh, its own version of the same incident. Their expert says video posted by the White House appears to have been altered to speed up Acosta's arm and make him look more aggressive. You'll notice that I actually had to cut down this video. I actually had to remove and, and separate the AP video because in the released video, three frames are repeated. Okay, so if I step through this, go one, two, three, and you can see there's no movement at all here and there should be movement because it's fluid and if you look at the original it's fluid so it looks like this was frozen and the reason it was probably frozen is because later on in the video it was sped up sped up to make it look like uh, Acosta was kinda karate chopping the woman's arm the video posted by Sanders appears to have originally been posted by an editor for the conservative conspiracy website Infowars he told BuzzFeed he took it from uh, something posted by another website. That is a lower quality version of a video. May explain why it looks different from the actual footage of the event. But again, that arm movement appears to have been sped up.